Hey guys, welcome back to my channel where I talk about the NWSL, women's soccer, just soccer, only soccer. In this video slash podcast, I'll be discussing the quarterfinal after dark match between OL Reign and Angel City FC. OL Reign are coming off of a win against the Chicago Red Stars, while Angel City are coming off of a win against the Portland Thorns. The NWSL regular season has concluded, and now we are in the postseason. Since this is a playoff match, this match can go into extra time and even down to penalties. Since this is also an after dark match, I'm almost expecting it to. When it came to the Reigns last match against the Chicago Red Stars, I didn't get to see it because for some reason all the games that Sunday were at 5 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time and I wanted to see how the Orlando Pride would close out their season. They also won. <laughs> At the same time, I was still following OL Reign on Footmob. I was aware that the Reign needed to win against the Red Stars in order to move on to the playoffs, so I was kind of worried about the Reign not scoring in the first half. But then Pino and Fishlock started scoring in the second half, and OL Reign were able to come away with a 3-0 win. When it comes to Angel City, though, I think the Reign are needing to put this game away as early as possible because in their final match of the regular season, Angel City was able to win 5-1 against the Portland Thorns in what had to be Bella Bixby's worst match of the season. The Reign should be alright defensively. I don't think they will let the scoreline get that high, but an issue the Reign were having in their past matches had to do with that connection between the midfield and attack and the connection in the attack and in the box. There were mo um, there would be moments where the team would look disjointed and disconnected in the midfield and attack, and there would just be no attacking rhythm from the rain. When it comes to this match, the rain are needing to find that connection and rhythm in the attack. There needs to be better control in the midfield as well. The rain cannot and should not wait till the second half to attack and try to score goals. The Reign are really needing to overwhelm Angel City as much as possible. Kind of what I've been saying about Vaf at Wolfsburg, I want to see more from the attack. I want to see more services, more connection in the attack, and more attempts on goal. I want to see all this early on from the Reign in the first half, because when it comes to Angel City, they have showed that they have players who can and will score. It's not a matter of how, but when. That all being said, let's get into the lineup for this match. All right, so the lineup. 4-3-3 or 4-2-3-1. We have Claudia Dickey in the goal. For defender, Sofia Huerta, Alana Cook, Lou Barnes, and Phoebe McLaren. In the midfield and attack, Emily Sonnet, Quinn, Jess Fishlock, Veronica Latsko, Jordan Heitema, and Megan Rapino. Overall, it's a good lineup. I believe the backline and defense will be all right in this match. Claudia Dickey has also been improving as well. I like this midfield of Sonic, Quinn, and Fishlock. There's good um, control and stability with Sonic and Quinn, but at the same time, Fishlock and Sonic will also be pressing with the attack. It's great to see Latsko starting. She'll provide um, great press and drive in the attack. The biggest question I still have is, will the rain team be able to get their attack forward? Will the midfield and attack be able to connect where it counts? It's going to be interesting to see how the Reign are going to execute their attack and if they'll execute it effectively. Now let's get into the first half. All right, so the first half, we are off. Let the after dark madness begin. Reign are in a 4-3-3. Angel City are in a 4-2-4. One minute long ball to the Reign box, headed away. Where to throw into Fishlock? Fishlock near the box, cleared. Heights him across, defended away. Where to back to Cook? McLaren fouled, rain ball. Two minutes, let's go cross, Pino heads it down, Fishlock can't get on it, defended away. Haitama, let's go, defended away. Three minutes, great recovery by Quinn. Long ball up for Pino, collected by the keeper. Angel City cross, kicked away by Cook. Four minutes, Angel City corner kick, headed straight up. I thought that went in the goal, but it didn't. <laughs> Um, rain defends it away. Fishlock fouled. Rain ball. Scary stuff. <laughs> Five minutes. McLaren and throw and defend it away. Six minutes. Rain foul. Angel City ball. Seven minutes. Angel City cross or attempt saved by Dickey. Huerta running up to Latsko. Latsko cross blocked. 
Eight minutes, Cook sends it up, kick back to the keeper. Nine minutes, Sonnet fouls, Angel City ball. Angel City almost on the ball, cleared by Latsko. Ten minutes, Angel City foul, rain ball. Eleven minutes, Quinn up to Huerta, intercepted. Pino collects over to Fishlock, taken away. Twelve minutes, Angel City in the rain box, cleared. Pino, Fishlock, Fishlock attempt from D, saved. She saw the keeper off her line and just went for it. <laughs> Um, 13 minutes, long ball to the rain box. Angel City recovers, crosses, blocked by Barnes. 14 minutes, ball in the rain box. Angel City attempt goes over. 15 minutes, Cook up for Huerta taken away. Let's go fouled, push, rain ball. 16 minutes, Pino up to Let's go headed away. Through ball into the rain box, tackled away by Barnes. 17 minutes, Angel City corner kick, headed around, kicked away. Angel City cross, sent over by Angel City. <laughs> 18 minutes, fish locked down, trainers out to check on her. Getting her legs stretched out, she seems to be okay. <laughs> okay, 20th minute, Harvey almost hit by the ball. She kind of dodged it in a weird way. <laughs> I need a reaction picture of that. Also, if you're seeing the picture, it means I found it. <laughs> Pino fouled, rain ball. 22 minutes, Quinn down, holding her ankle. She's okay. Caught some studs. <laughs> 24 minutes, Barnes up to Haitama. Haitama up to Pino, defended away. 25 minutes, Sonnet foul, handball. Angel City free kick outside the rain box. 26 minutes, Angel City sends it in, kicked away. Angel City cross, cleared. Let's go fouled, rain ball. 27 minutes, Haitama, Pino, miscommunication there, taken away. 28 minutes, Barnes, fish lock, taken away. 29 minutes, Angel City on the attack, Rain able to recover. Angel City cross, Angel City attempt, Dickey saves. Good save by Dickey. 30th minute, ball to the Rain box, goes out of play. 32 minutes, McLaren fouled, Rain ball. Sonnet up to Haitama, taken away. 33 minutes, Let's go making a run, tackled away. Let's go fouled, Rain free kick. 34 minutes, Pino sends it in, Quinn header cleared. Pino cross, kicked away. 35 minutes, Huerta cross, saved. Good attack from the rain, but we need them to keep it up. Ball down the rain right wing goes out. 36 minutes, fish lock, Pino taken away. 37 minutes, rare bad giveaway by Huerta. Angel City in the box, plays it wide. Angel City cross blocked, Angel City cross again. Huerta fouled, rain ball. Yeah, Huerta has to do better than that. The back line cannot make mistakes like that. 39 minutes, ball in the rain box, Dickey saves, 40th minute, Pino gives it away, not on the same page, at, um, not on the same page as whoever that was meant for. <laughs> um, 41 minutes, Angel City making a run, goes out of play, Quinn clears, 42 minutes, McLaren up to Haitama, tackled away, no foul apparently, from the replay, it is a foul, like that was all Haitama and no ball, so bad no call by the ref. 43 minutes, Pino fouls, Angel City ball. Ball to the rain side, goes out. There's just no support in the rain midfield. 44 minutes, Angel City cross, defended away. Angel City cross, Dickey saves. Rain counterattack, lots of action in the box. Pino cross, defended away. 45 minutes, Cook sends it in, kicked away. Two minutes of added time. Where to cross, Pino collects. Pino, <laughs> not Megs, runs into the box, puts it out though. 46 minutes, Angel City on the attack, Sonnet recovers, better from Sonnet. 47 minutes, whistle blown, first half ends, rain, nil nil. It's not a bad first half from the rain, but it kind of looks like the rain's previous matches. The backline and defense are doing well. As always, there's good support in the defense. Dickey also had some good saves in this half as well. However, there's not much control and stability in the rain midfield. The rain attack has been able to get forward, and when they do, there is good crosses and services, but I want to see more from the attack. I want to see more crosses and services from players like Huerta, Latsko, Rapino, and Fishlock. But in order for the rain to create more of those chances in the attack, they have to have better control of the midfield, they have to have better possession. At the same time, the Rain are needing to be more aggressive and direct with their attack. The Rain are considered a second half team, and usually they tend to kick it into high gear in the second half. If the Rain want to win this match and move on to the semifinals, they have to start getting their attack forward and creating more chances. 
That being said, let's get into the second half. All right, so the second half, we are off. 45 minutes, Haitama giveaway. <laughs> Ball down the rain wing, Huerta defends it away. 46 minutes, Angel City making a run, can't get through Huerta. Um, can't get through Huerta, rain recovers. Angel City giveaway, Fishlock off to Pino. Pino attempt from D, goes over. Very close though, it kind of just skimmed over the crossbar. 47 minutes, Angel City plays it up, goes out. 48 minutes, Angel City cross, goes out. Barnes up to Latsko, kicked away. 49 minutes, ball over to Huerta, taken away. Ball in for Pino goes wide. 50th minute, Sonnet recovers. Rain counter, not quite. Played back. Huerta cross, headed away. 51 minutes, let's go cross off the post. Fishlock attempt cleared off the line. Also very close. Huerta cross goes over. 52 minutes, Pino tackles it away, makes a run. Pino attempt saved. 53 minutes, rain corner kick short. Huerta cross, defended away. McLaren skies it. Let's go fouled, rain ball. 54 minutes, Huerta sends it in, defended away. Ball to the rain side, Cook back to Dickey. McLaren sends it up, no one there. Huerta cross, headed away. 55 minutes, Fishlock brought down, no foul. Um, good by Quinn. I'm not sure what they did, but apparently they did something good. I just can't remember what it was. 56 minutes, Angel City cross, Dickey catches it. 58 minutes, Haitama goes down, no foul. Lavelle prepping to come in. Let's go up to Fishlock, not on the same page. 50th minute, let's go down the wing, shub, no foul. Pino foul soon after, grabbing. I mean, Pino did foul, yes, but why wasn't the obvious foul on let's go not called? 61 minutes, Angel City cross defended away, dangerous though. <laughs> Angel City cross played back. 62 minutes, Angel City attempt goes wide, deflected apparently. 63 minutes, Angel City corner kick, caught by Dickey, good save by Dickey. Pino touch up to McLaren and goes out. Rain substitution now. Quinn out, Lavelle in. 64 minutes, ball touched into the rain box, Dickey collects. Fishlock sends it up, Angel City collects. 65 minutes, Huerta attempt from D, saved. Huerta touch up to Latsko, not on the same page, goes out. Yeah, that connection in the box, that needs to be better. <laughs> 66 minutes, Pino to Lavelle kicked away. 67 minutes, Huerta cross blocked. Lavelle fouled, pulled down, rain free kick outside the box. 68 minutes, Pino attempt from D goes over. 69 minutes, long ball to the rain box, headed away. 70th minute, Angel City through ball, kicked away by Cook. Ball sent into the rain box, headed away, sent back in, defended away. Laval making a run off to Pino. Pino cross Haitama or Latsko misses it. <laughs> 71 minutes, Angel City counter, defended away by Huerta and Sonnet. 72 minutes, ball touched into the rain box. Dickey collects. 73 minutes, Angel City cross headed away. Angel City cross blocked by Pino. Angel City attempt from D. Dickey saves. 74 minutes, McLaren up to Haitama headed away. Great recovery by Sonnet. 75 minutes, Sonnet recovers again, <laughs> up to Haitama. Haitama fouled, yellow card for Angel City's McCaskill. Haitama down, trainers out to check on her, check on her. Balser prepping to come in, Haitama still down. 77 minutes, rain substitution, Haitama out, Balser in. Haitama getting helped off, uh, not good, doesn't look good. Hopefully she's okay. 78 minutes, rain ball, Cook sends it in, headed away, sent back in, saved. 79 minutes, long ball to the rain box, headed away. 81 minutes, Cook fouls, light shove, Angel City free kick. Ball sent into the rain box, um, headed away times two. 82 minutes, Angel City player down, small collision with Pino, she's okay. 83 minutes, fish lock fouls, Angel City ball. 84 minutes, great recovery from Cook, Lavelle attempt from D, saved. 85 minutes, rain corner kick, headed up, McLaren can't get on it, Cook sends it in, headed away. 86 minutes, Pino cross, Sonnet touch, kicked away. Pino cross, Bosser misses it, kicked away. Bosser, how do you miss that? 87 minutes, Barnes or McLaren cross, Las Latsko heads it in, rain, 1-0. Great by Latsko, but let's hold on to this lead. <laughs> Angel City cross, Dickey collects and slowly picks it up. <laughs> Um, I heard we have six minutes of added time. Yeah, we have to either hold on or just score another goal.
89 minutes, ball to the rain box, kicked away. Fishlock fouled, fishlock down, taken out from behind. Fishlock coming off, should be coming back in though. Four minutes of added time, good. <laughs> 90th minute, Pino up to Balser. Balser takes it all the way to the Angel City side. 91 minutes, Sonnet up to Pino, goes out. Lavelle, back cross, Latsko can't get on it. Angel City making a run, great tackle by Barnes. 92 minutes, rain substitutions. Pino and Huerta out, Vanderjak and Stanton in. Haitama is on the bench. Like, I can see her on the bench, and she seems to be okay, but I don't know yet. Huerta yellow card for delaying a restart. <laughs> um, 94 minutes, Angel City cross goes wide. 95 minutes, Stanton clears, rain with another clearance. Ball to the rain side, then nothing from it. Uh, whistle blown, second half ends. Oh, well, rain wins, 1 0. Oh, well, rain now moves on to the NWSL Championship semifinals. At first, I thought this match was going to go into extra time, but Latsko's goal in the 87th minute sealed Angel City's fate and sends the rain through. This second half was a lot better for the rain. There was more pressing and driving in the attack, better control and possession in the midfield. I was a little concerned when Quinn was subbed off for Rose Lavelle, but Sonnet was doing really well at controlling the midfield. She had some good touches and recoveries. Rose Lavelle coming in was a good attacking change for the rain. Despite coming back from injury, Lavelle looked great on the ball, good with her runs, dribbles, and counters. Um, Rapino and Fishlock were also doing really well. They were able to get forward more in the second half and, like Lavelle, were doing well on the counter. Defensively, the rain were great. <laughs> uh, that is to be expected. They shut down Angel City's crosses and services and locked down their goal in the final few um, minutes remaining. I especially like the support in the defense because it really hindered Angel City. Angel City were creating some good chances but they couldn't get past the rain back line, which was solid tonight. Overall, this was a great win for the rain, and they will be moving on to the semifinals where they'll be facing the San Diego Wave. OL Rain's semifinal match against the San Diego Wave will be Sunday, November 5th. Uh, that's daylight savings time. <laughs> anyway, that is all I have for you guys today or tonight. Congrats to the rain. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one. Later.